We were looking for a big problem that we could address with technology, data, and analytics. When we first heard about the problem of the vaccine cold chain and the need for vaccines to be stored at the right temperatures, we immediately became interested. Power outages and other problems cause refrigerators to get too hot or too cold, and vaccines die. In India, a recent study showed that 75% of freeze-sensitive vaccines showed evidence of being damaged all over the world. The problem is vast, and often, despite vaccination, children are vulnerable to deadly diseases. We spent a lot of time listening to people who were really solving problems on the ground. And what we learned from that was cold chain sensor technology could actually provide a solution. So where do most good ideas start? In a garage. We pulled off the shelf components wherever we could. We used what was already built and we put stuff together to get that very first prototype. Since then, we've been designing and improving Cold Trace for three years. This is Cold Trace. The components are really simple. There's a low cost smartphone, a plastic box that we've manufactured in China, and a temperature probe the probe sits in a fridge, and the device sends out text messages when the fridge starts to fail. The key innovation here is that the temperature probe connects to the phone over the headset jack. What this means is that our temperature probe is off the shelf and extremely cheap. It costs about a dollar and has no battery, no electronic components. It's extremely simple to assemble, which means anyone can do it. The phone can record temperature data simply by playing a tone and recording a tone at the exact same time. And that's literally how the phone powers the sensor. Using our dashboard, health officials can view all of their vaccine cold chain equipment at one time. A Ministry of Health official is now able to ask, what has been the best performing fridge in my country? And how do we scale that up? A tremendous amount of resources and people and technology has to be marshaled in order to ensure one individual dose of vaccine reaches a child. Cold Trace helps make sure that that vaccine is safe. In the future, what I see is Cold Trace and other technologies like Cold Trace scaling up in every country so that as a sector, we are all confident that every single vaccine administered to a child is protecting kids the way that they're supposed to.